Absolute comrades and welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 2 Doomsday Armageddon. Now we're going to start time action. So yeah. Now I'm going to tell you about another aspect of the game is what the fuck United States tried but failed to send you a spy. You know what? We get only one response to sending our spies is spending spies to us ourselves. Like now we have one spy in Soviet Union. That will catch another spice. Okay. That's the only thing we will be use using KGB for. Okay, what I'm talking uh, historic events, yeah. Uh, that's to keep the atmosphere of the game to sink in the time to like feel what was happening then we will be shown in the text messages and in the windows okay uh, the right now is nothing happening like our unrest present is decreasing like trading okay nothing special but very soon very soon uh, the thing will happen start to happening like we the first I think will be his uh, war in Spain yeah, about summer like okay, I'll increase time speed but nothing really my plan is to decrease unrest to the like something like five percent or, or yeah five percent will be enough because uh, sometimes the historic events will happen and uh, will mess to your strategies like oh again failed okay we're not going to see this again and send another spy to ourselves yeah, historic events will happen and mess with your statistics like it will increase or decrease your unrest rate or like suddenly will give you a bunch of resources or will like offers you to give some of your resources to other countries uh, if you want and so on so we will uh, leave some unrest rate for the for the chance the uh, game decided to decrease it for our for us and uh, that will be a pretty much very good bonus yeah reinforcements okay yeah everything's good another spy super Th then uh, then we're going to sell our some ships, I will show you actually what I do to sell ships. We open negotiations, and I, uh, for instance, I'm going to sell some of our submarines because they are not efficient at all. And I choose resources: oil, of course, oil, some, some of this. Oh, I know. Okay. So this will be okay, and we will we have some bunch of resources and friends and got our submarines. Okay, let's continue. See February diplomacy. Mm, yeah, everything goes fine right now. We will eventually need to trade. Okay. Wait a second. For instance, I'm going to start trading with United Kingdom trade agreement. And what I'm going to do? I have a lot of metal and a lot of energy, and we need oil, but they don't have oil. And but they have 
they hey, they don't have money. Oh, that's strange. Okay, let's trade some metal for money. Because we will need money for negotiations. To start every negotiations you need a little bit of money and also uh, with money you can increase your relationship with other country like you see not Turkey. I don't need good relationship with Turkey yet. Germans maybe maybe with Germans but no. Not right now. Oh US, yeah. US is pretty good because <laughs> once I was attacked by US in a like back step, like like they uh, they invade here, and I didn't have enough forces to defeat it. So that was pretty bad of them. So we can influence nation and our relations with them increase ten points. Yay! But, uh, I don't really know if it's really important because uh, sometimes I was attacked by uh, countries with relations plus 100 uh, or even more so let's continue and by the way here is Moscow and right now I am somewhere about here so I'm right, right under his foot. So say hi to Vadim, to Mr. Vadim. Okay, nothing happening. Nothing. <laughs> Maybe we will no Poland. It will be destroyed. So this will be not efficient as we would like to be. Japan, yeah. Strangely enough, uh, G Germany and Japan doesn't often uh, become allies, so they very often act separately, even if you're playing for one of them. So, okay, I guess we can trade one more ship. Let's get a Right, yeah. You see, uh, U.S. have uh, unlimited, almost unlimited resources, amounts of oil. So, I think we should even start trading with them for oil. You see, we're right now we already have uh, about five thousand of oil units, and it's our unrest is going down intelligence okay let's send another spy and we don't want to see it again technology goes and such okay we can see now like Italy annexed Ethiopia okay that's it's always happening if Ethiopians have no chance so let's continue you know what? Let's continue in another video. <coughs> right now it's March 16th. This is Vadim, and you're dismissed.